all new at 11 tonight. As the investigation into the Antioch Police Department grows, two U.S. congressmen are calling on the U.S. Department of Justice to investigate. This all comes as three chapters of the NAACP will be meeting with the Contra Costa County District Attorney next week. ABC 7 News reporter Ansar Hassan has the latest twist to the scandal. We've got a very urgent situation in Antioch right now, and the Department of Justice has to be part of the solution. U.S. Congressman Mark Desaigne, who represents large parts of Contra Costa County and much of Antioch, is responding to the texting scandal at the Antioch Police Department. He and Congressman John Garamendi have written to the U.S. Department of Justice to launch a formal investigation. Be aware that right at this moment, uh, we have some real constitutional issues and some public safety issues and some racism that we have to address immediately. This comes after published reports reveal a chain of racist and homophobic text messages sent by Antioch police officers over a period of almost two years. And according to the Contra Costa County Public Defender's Office, close to 40% of the entire police force may have been involved. You've been representing Contra Costa County in Antioch for a long time. These text messages go back years. Have you ever had any inclination that this was going on in Antioch or that it was so prevalent? I'm not naive, but I certainly didn't expect anything remotely like this. Desanya gave the GOJ until May 5th to respond. But he adds it won't end there. He will reach out to California Attorney General Rob Bonta and request a meeting with Antioch Police Chief Stephen Ford. This type of racism in these kind of professions is um, a, a very large warning sign, sound to me. Um, it should be to every American. Odessa Le Francois is president of the East County chapter of the NAACP, which includes Antioch. She supports a DOJ investigation. The more eyes, the more things that we can see. We don't want to miss anything. This is an opportunity to right some wrongs that have been wrong for a long time. She's even calling for federal oversight of the Antioch Police Department. East County will join two other East Bay chapters of the NAACP on Tuesday for a meeting with Contra Costa County DA Diana Becton to present their concerns. It's one thing to be falsely accused of a crime, but the second thing is for the legal system to you know, victimize you and once they know a wrong has been um, committed, to be able to correct that wrong. In Antioch, Ansar Hassan, ABC 7 News.